You know, this film really should have been called A Love in Tennis or Love Drama Plus Tennis. Aside from all that, Challengers absolutely rules. I love this film. Probably my favorite film of the year. And honestly, this is Zendaya's best performance in a movie, in my very own opinion. I honestly like her better in this movie. No, way better in this movie than Dune Part 2. Not to say that her performance in Dune Part 2 was bad, it's just her performance in this one absolutely crushes. I seriously love how Zendaya's character is put in this difficult situation between two men who love her a lot. I love how this film goes from past, present, and somewhat future. The whole vibe of this threesome relationship is brilliant. I absolutely love their romance and tension. I gotta say, throughout this movie, I was confused if Mike or Josh's characters were actually loving each other, like they actually had feelings for each other secretly, or were they just friends being weird? I know this will not be winning any awards, but the score in this movie is so unique, I love it. I would actually listen to this type of score every single day, just like I did for the score for Across the Spider-Verse. The fucking camera moves in this movie is absolutely brilliant. Like, when they are hitting the ball, the camera moves with the ball. Like, what? I will definitely be watching this movie for a second time in the movie theater. Indefinitely. This film is going to be getting a 9.5 out of 10. And for now, until Deadpool and Wolverine comes out, this is my favorite film of 2024. By the way, did I mention that this movie was very, very sexy?